Hi guys, I hope that all of you are doing well during this pandemic. On this occasion, I want to show you about combination. But before that, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe this video. Okay, let's get started. And on this topic, not only talk about the definition of a combination, but also accompanied by example and practice questions and discussion. Combination is a technique that expresses the many ways in arranging several objects from a group regardless of order. Thus, if there are objects that are only different in order, then it is not allowed or will be considered the same objects. Consider the following example. There are how many ways that might happen? If the child is allowed to take two balls at random in a box containing color shape, red, green, and blue. In taking the ball, the order is not considered meaning that it is not permitted about the order. The example keywords above are not allowed to be taken, so we must answer in the form of a combination, red, green, red, blue, and green, blue. Thus, there are only three ways. A combination of other ways will mean the same or be considered one, such as red-green with green-red will be considered one way. From the explanation and example of the problem above, in making it easier for us to calculate opportunities or the number of ways that can be formed by using a combination can be formulated like this. Now, let's get into practice. There are 10 people who pass the selection in a company, but the workforce needs as many as 4 people. That determine how many ways the company did in selecting 4 out of 10 people pass the selection. None. N is equals 10, where N states the number who pays the selection. And K is equals 4 where K refers to the workforce received or selected. Put all that is known into the combination formula. Then, the number of ways companies can do to choose for out of 10 people who pass the selection is 210 ways. Not only in mathematics, the combination also has benefits in our daily lives. For example, in calculating how many ways you can do to choose clothes that feel appropriate or suitable. Well, after the explanation I gave, can you understand now? I hope you all understand this material. That is the material that I can convey to all of you. Hopefully, it can be useful in solving problems about the combination. Don't forget to share with others so that more and more people understand this combination material. I'm Angelia from the Faculty of Mathematics and Natural Sciences Samratulangi University. Thank you very much for watching and thank you very much for coming to my YouTube channel. I hope you enjoy with my video. See you next time and goodbye.